every day that a girl from the inner city becomes an overnight sensation, but in 2014, Monet Davis did just that when she pitched in the Little League World Series. So what exactly has the now 16-year-old been up to since her breakthrough? I caught up with her at the Great American Ballpark to talk about the RBI World Series, where she is pitching as part of the Phillies RBI team. Monet, you became an overnight sensation three years ago in the Little League World Series. What has life been like for you post-World Series? Um, at first it was pretty crazy. But then it started to calm down and got to focus on basketball a little more. But going to baseball tournaments, it's kind of like gets a little rough. When uh, one person starts to notice you, then they tell their whole team. And the other teams find out, and it kind of gets crazy, but it's all right. One of the other things you handle gracefully is being on an all-boys baseball team. What's that like for you? Um, well, I've played with those guys since I was seven. So like I grew up with them. I've known them my whole life and it's just once like once I first started playing it was a little rough but then after that like we just became one big family and they protect me I protect them playing at the World Series a lot of people thought like oh it's Little League everything's so much closer so that's probably why she's dominating but being out here and showing that I can not just play Little League that I can play on the bigger field and still hang with them just like proved a lot to a lot of people because they didn't think I would be able to do it. So once I did that, I think I'm pretty relieved now that I have a game under my belt and I'm ready for more competition. The competition is a lot different compared to regionals, but it's I like it. It'll make our whole team better. And it seems like we're all just like coming together no matter what team it is. We're all talking to each other and being friendly to each other. And hopefully it stays like that throughout the whole week and we just win some games. And you go back, you're going to play some ping pong, you said. What do you tell your teammates to get their, their spirits back up for the next game? Whenever we're in a game like this, I always try to make them like cheer up and get them pumped up because these games are like, really down. Like You get kind of mad at yourself. So I always just like, cheer them up, like, like we'll be fine, and just kind of make them laugh because once they start laughing, then everybody will start laughing. It'll just get everybody pumped up. And I just tell them it's all right. Like, you got to lose in order to learn. So that's what I told our pitcher today, and he was, he was struggling afterwards, but I think he pulled it together once we started talking. I told him it'll be all right. We'll see them again, and you can get your revenge, and I think he was fine with that. If you don't lose, you don't learn. Wise words from a 16-year-old. And Monet Davis, the world will be watching as your future unfolds.